Good Friday morning. It's about 11.15 here on Friday. We're just leaving work and we're headed to a new destination. We've never been over to, this is how the way she be the first mate here. We've never been to uh, New Buffalo and so some of our uh, followers and our inspiration actually for getting our boat channel, uh, Ben and Dana from the uh, Sea Pickle 2 are going to meet us over there. So we're going to go have a weekend with them at New Buffalo. Check out the lake. The lake's supposed to be uh, the waves one foot or less. Yeah. Which Perfect. is always good. No rain until possibly late Saturday night or Sunday. So hoping that stays away. But uh, we're hoping to have a great time. So we're on our way over there to meet them and we're going to go get wet. So see you there. Welcome to New Buffalo. We are at the city boat launch and they charge you, well, they get different rates, but they charge each time, for each day you're here actually, and you have to get a pass to put on your boat. So they give you a little green thing you gotta put on your boat, it tells you what you paid, and then they got a thing you put in your window. So we've got that done. Beautiful day if I haven't said it, take a drink. Um, mid 70s mid to upper 70s and if you can see in the distance here there's there's the marina over there so we're putting in at the river and then lake michigan's right there so our uh, friends from the sea pickle are on their way should be here shortly so we're gonna get this thing ready and get her wet all right we are here in new buffalo and with our new friends from the sea pickle too Hello. this is dana and the captain ben and rj is asleep in the in the truck so well, check it out. Here is the Sea Pickle 2. Nice and dirty, fresh out of storage. You may know them from their videos, which is actually the story of our inspiration that got us started in the boating, was watching their Lake Michigan Adventures trip. So I'll put a link below if we can, if I can figure out how to do it, where we can uh, show the link to their, their channel where they've got some, uh, some short clips on the North Channel. And then you've got two really good videos on cruising around the uh, the Great Lakes on a 16 day adventure, right? So it was a lot of fun, so check it out. So we're gonna get these boats ready to go and we're gonna get wet. but we uh, found out that he's got a dry water pump. Somehow, put it in and it's not picking up any water. So he's got the water pump out and it's dry as a bone. So we're gonna have to back wash and see if there's anything blocking. See if we can't get it running here. Otherwise, we're not gonna be able to go very far. Not a real good start so far. Not a good start. And you lost a screw. And I lost a screw. Oh, classic. So, typical boating weekend. What are you doing, bub? Look who we got here. It's a whole family of duckies. Our kids used to call these quackers. Do you call them quackers or ducks? How you feed them. Look at that. What do you think, quacker? You guys hungry? Get you some food. ducks on one side, geese on another. Yeah. And you see the water level is a little high here as the water's <laughs> over the over the fingers. Luckily we got one that's just just that we got. See pickle and in in Lena's terms sitting there ready to go except for Ben still got some issues.
Here's the fun part. You talk, talk to the, talk to the other boater and say, "Come on in there, boat. How you doing there, Sea Pickle?" Come in, Sea Pickle. Come in, Sea Pickle. <laughs> that one's a little bit different. Do you talk on the radio? <laughs> Apparently, in <it's> some silly voice. <laughs> Everybody's gotta have a silly voice. You gotta have a silly yeah. voice. <laughs> this is RJ's silly voice. <laughs> okay, enough. Are you having fun? We're having fun. We're on the boat. It's always fun. Water level's pretty high. And it's pretty mucky. All this duckweed blowing in. But you can see the sea pickle too. All set up. Get a shot here from the side. A really nice 268 sea wind or four wind four winds vista. Here comes the first mate. We're gonna walk up to the what's the name of this restaurant? Uh, I don't know which Something one we're going dog, to. Right? Are we going to the dog or we go to the burger place? No, the Salty dog or no? What is it called? I don't remember the name of it. I'll tell you when we get there. Let's okay. look around. We've got some condos here. We're going to walk the harbor here and get a little bit better view, but it seems to be a pretty nice place. All of these docks right here are all transient slips. And you see, we got some rinkers here. And we got some bigger boats down here and sailboat. And the water level is really high. It looks like it's probably about two to three feet higher than what it probably normally is. Pretty high. But due to all the uh, rains that we've had for a while, it's a nice train sound coming through. But we're going to go check out this place. I think it's the Sly Dog, Salty Dog, something. We'll find out. Alright, so the name of the place is called the Stray Dog Bar and Grill. So we got the whole crew here, the crew of Sea Pickle. What do you say, buddy? You ready to go eat? Yeah! <laughs> and uh, this would be the stray dog. Looks like a fun place and it smells really good. So let's go check inside of the stray dog. It looks to be quite packed. Looks like they're doing quite a bit of business here. It smells really good, too. Got some nice fancy drinks. Yeah, Got some sangria. Drink. What are you gonna have? I don't know. I think I'm gonna do the mahi fish tacos. Hey, buddy, you catching any fish? RJ, you're on video. I'm behind you. Huh? <laughs> are you catching fish? Got your cool You're fishing hat. It's a nice fishing hat. Yeah. And what kind of rod and reel you got here? Got Spider Man. Spider Man. <laughs> Very nice. Shakespeare. Just... All right, buddy. Let's see you catch a whopper. Cereals too. I got a thing of strawberries. Did you get a bite? Got some okay, let's put it back in. Got some pepperoni. Okay, that's the goal. Superman! You know what, that might be better part of the day. Oh, ice cream. Who screams for ice cream? We're definitely going to have to check that out. Put some down. New boat bag. So we are going to check out Beachside Scoops. That's RJ where we're going. RJ, where are we going, buddy? Where are we going? <laughs> his, big, his big moment. Yeah. Big moment. He messed it up. He passed it up. Passed it up. 
So we're gonna check out. Oh, they have tracks. Oh boy, look at all those flavors. And this one. The better brownie batter. Brownie batter? I am doing the raspberry dark chocolate raspberry truffle. Mmm, that looks so good. Look at that. Mmm, that is yummy stuff. What are you getting, Ben? This chocolate peanut butter. Yeah? Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, so this is how the other half lives. That hatch opens up and the dinghy pulls inside. Large twin platform. And get this, portable hot tub on the bow. That's living. That is living. I don't know if we can get that on the on our rinker, but that would Let's be try. pretty cool. So portable hot tub. That on the top of our How crazy would that be? Put a hot tub on the front of our boat. Hey, we got a few more boats pulling in. So this is how the the other half lives. And then you get the poor half down here. <laughs> the tiny boats. The tiny boats within layman's terms and the sea pickle. But we have good time. Our current setup. We both got our tenders blown up and ready for operation. thing it is a beautiful day take a drink even if it's gone <laughs> did you sleep well first mate yes awesome i tell you sleeping on the boat is second to none so relaxing so calming so so nice so here we are at new buffalo saturday morning Guys, nice gentle breeze. It's warm already. It's supposed to get up in the 80s today, so it's gonna be a nice day. And we're gonna, there's a river behind us, if you can see that. We cross through when we come uh, from the boat launch. But we're gonna get the dinghies out, and uh, we're gonna do some exploring with the dinghies. And we'll probably go out on the lakes and uh, head out somewhere too, because the lake's supposed to be one foot or less, which is fantastic on Lake Michigan. And there's a nice town here within walking distance in New Buffalo. We're going to go check it out. And we haven't even been over the other side of the marina yet. We're going to check out the other side of the marina where all the uh, permanent slips are. And uh, just enjoy this gorgeous day and see what the, this area has to offer. So our friends aboard the Sea Pickle are just getting up. You can see Ben over there. And there's RJ. Okay. He's just coming out of hiding. So they're uh, getting up and around and uh, getting the first cups of coffee going. Good we'll figure out what we're going to do for breakfast. We do have a little bit of our favorite on, uh, well, not please for everybody, a quickie breakfast. Our little mini cinnamon rolls are very good. And then, of course, the first mate's omelets are second to none. Boat omelets are, are the best. So that's where we're at right now. So stay tuned. Pepperoni versus Which some of your. Uh, fake Fake bait? Fake pepperoni versus plastic. Plastic. Is my carp set up? Four pound test. I got a nice chartreuse. Okay. Grub or whatever you call these things. So far. Alright.
water, buddy? Yeah. Yeah? Fresh, fresh. A little chilly. We got a little cloud cover rolling in, but still pretty nice out. We took a dinghy right out to see what the water looked like, and got a little bit of chop. They got yellow flag up, but uh, it's still only one to two foot. Still not bad at all. Alright, so we got a little repair going on here with the Johnson, the big Johnson recoil crapped out. Just need to so lock the spring in place. Just for tonight. Just for tonight. Just so this is this is called boat rigging 101. And you do with what you can with what you got. I don't know if we need to punch that hole a little bigger. Let me try it. Punch it a little bigger. Punch a little bigger. All right, watch this technique here. This is primitive weapons. This is our hammer. This is our punch, and it works. Let's try that. Look at there. Do what you got to do to make it work. <clears throat> there she goes. Yep. All right. Bingo. I think that'll work. Bingo was his name though. Sometimes that's what you gotta do. Yeah. You just gotta figure it out. When you got limited resources. Will it work? And it is a beautiful day here in New Buffalo. So we're uh, I got the dinghy all suited up. Got the Merc on it. Full of fuel, and we're going to take a boat ride here and check out the river. Hey, we're out on the dinghy. Got a good time with the old Mercer 33. It's fun out here on this uh, Galleon River at New Buffalo, Michigan. So we're having a good time dinging it. A lot of fun. Are you enjoying your dinghy ride? We're riding in Dinker Doo. Having a blast. Dinker Doo. Look at that bus crash. Sunday morning, just getting uh, morning coffee going. We do have some rain showers, it's pretty gray, overcast. Looks like it's going to rain for a couple hours yet this morning. And then, well, it looks like we got a, an opening, and then it's hopefully going to get a little bit nicer. It might be cloudy, but we'll see. Still, a rainy day on the boat is still better than a day at work. But uh, Miss Beck's down in the cabin making us some nice eggs, and we're enjoying our coffee, and just sitting out watching watching the rain and enjoying our company with our, our new friends from the Sea Pickle, Ben and Dana and RJ. So it's a, been a great trip so far. We've had a lot of fun. Really haven't gone anywhere. We've, we've gone a total of a quarter mile maybe down from the river down to the dock and we've just sat here and enjoyed it. Enjoyed New Buffalo. Great little town. Went into town and had some ice cream. Got good ice cream places. I got a good restaurant there. The, the Stray Dogs are a great restaurant. Got good food. Nice atmosphere. Uh, we've got a party deck on top. Last night we could hear it right from the right from the boat. It's pretty lively. But uh, it's a beautiful marina. Miss Beck and I took a dinghy ride last night around. Went over by the gas dock and cruised out and seen the fire in the sky sunset. It was very nice. So we'll give this one a thumbs up. The good marina. Nice place to visit. Definitely be back. Um, some of the scummy stuff's moved back in again. It moved out last night, but it's kind of come back in again, and there's some debris in here. The water's about three feet over level, and uh, I guess one downside we'd have to give it is they don't have floating docks here. And so uh, sometimes 
probably doesn't happen that often that the uh, docks are underwater and the first dock we were in and had a lot of duckweed on it so we've moved over we're, uh, we uh ours is about two inches above uh, it's not too bad and some of these other boats are from the marina the municipal marina has a lot of docks underwater over there where the permanent residents are and it's pretty bad so uh we need the water level to go down, definitely. There's a lot of water, a lot of debris, uh, too much rain, but it's been good. Always fun, putting stuff away in the rain. In the rain. Well, at least we got this nice canopy. We can get the, put our dinghies away, get them cleaned up. This thing has a, pressure side and a vacuum side so we can suck suck the air out of it vacuum it down you're doing a great job Scott looking good <laughs> hey <laughs> little foggy today compared to yesterday there's a sea pickle over there a little rolly <laughs> We got the first mates. You got all your jobs done? Yes, check. Check. Of course, everything's pretty soggy right now, so we'll have to put everything back up when we get home and uh, dry everything out. But all in all, it was fun. Did you guys have a good time? Yeah, we had a great weekend. Had a great weekend? Yeah. We had a lot of fun meeting up with uh, with these guys and, and boating with us. Glad yeah. you guys let us join us, or let us join you. We finally launched Sea Pickle this year. Yeah. Finally got Sea Pickle in the water. <laughs> Yeah, we were supposed to be down at Cumberland for the rinker meetup, but uh, the weather wasn't looking good, so we opted to come here, and we still got rain. So <laughs> <laughs> we still got rain. <laughs> but it's a closer drive. We got a two-hour drive versus a six-hour six. drive or more. Seven. But uh, it's been a pleasure boating yes. with you guys and it meeting is. you guys finally. Definitely. And we really enjoyed our time with you guys, and so I'm hoping that you guys did the same, if, if you Absolutely. don't mind. And uh, we'll do this again soon. Better weather. Better, Better weather. weather. Yeah. Yeah. And less problems. And less problems. And less problems, <laughs> yeah. yeah. You got anything else to say? Stay tuned. About like and subscribe. Like, you wanna... subscribe. I forget, it's yeah. new. <laughs> it's the first time of the year. Like, subscribe. Like, Leave subscribe. us a comment. Leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. All right, very good. All right. <laughs> Layman out. <laughs>